gender gap across the world widened for the first time in a decade, in 2017. This is due to the fact that in 60 countries, they were not really following the, uh, the promotion of women. The UPF uh, organization, it's, it is uh, the wife that's leading, leading the, the group now all over the world, Dr. Abdul Moon. It is amazing to me, it's amazing to imagine it's a very powerful husband he had, mm -hmm. she had, and it's, it, I love him a lot, but he, he passed away. But, but the point is, she is doing it differently. She lets us take charge. She said, you know, how do you get peace and, and goodness and whatever? It is really to the logic of love. I've heard this, when I've heard this, oh, what does that mean? Because, you know, all these thousands of years, men are leading by the logic of power, yeah? That must stop. It does not mean that women should become powerful and, you know, start using men's uh, qualities. We have tremendous qualities that men can't, can't possess, you know? Um, we need men also, not just the women who've, who've broken the ceiling, but, but, but Actually, we need men. Without men, you can't go forward. I mean, the, 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 the lawmakers are men most of the time, you know? So therefore, we have to really call on men, you know, to help us. We have to cooperate together. We are made for each other, to be honest, you know? Men and women must go together. Otherwise, something is missing. We're not complimentary otherwise. And sometimes they need a kick in the butt, of, I'm sure. <laughs> but, <laughs> but, but without them, we, it's not complete, you know? So we have to really think in this logic, with love, with compassion. What, what do women have men don't come near to is human understanding, relationship, um, reconciliation, understanding of negotiation, you know? You know, it's not us that, that are losing. Actually, the world is losing. The e economy is losing. Our, our power of negotiation, of love, of compassion, of negotiation, of understanding, of peacemaking, all those things, you know, the world is losing, the, the society is losing, economy is losing. Our founder said, this is the age of women. Honestly, very interestingly, he said that it's women that should take the, the lead. Because, in, especially in peacekeeping, and funnily enough, I found it very strange that a few months or a year later, actually UN was saying that, that in peacekeeping you need more women, more negotiators. It's get really interesting, isn't it? So we're, we're hearing it from many, many areas. Let's do it. We have to use women's powers, women's abilities, women's love, women's, women's nature to really take lead in this society.